Hi, I'm Tim Bond with Juki America, and today we are at EEM, the Everything Embroidery Market Trade Show here in Biloxi, Mississippi. And we're going to talk about our Rico printer today. And I'm calling it a printer because that's exactly what it is. It's a direct to garment printer. Now, everybody thinks that this is a complicated process, but I'm going to try and make it as easy as possible for you to understand because it really is that easy. You see, this unit in front of me has two parts to it. It has a printer part and a fixer part. And the printer part is what actually is going to print on the fabric. The fixer part is what makes the process of permatizing or making permanent the ink onto the fabric even easier. Now, why do we want to make it easier? Because it'll make it faster for you to get an end result that you're happy with. Now, we talked about it being a printer at the beginning, right? So let's start with that. I can use any program on my PC I'd like to, as long as I can send whatever image or text I have to a printer. Because once I've loaded the software driver for the printer into the PC, it just loads like another printer. So I can send it to a printer, like you would send it to your inkjet printer or your laser printer, or maybe you're sending it to a PDF. It's the same, except I'm gonna select the Rico printer. And you can see here, I've got a little picture up that I've been playing with. And if I just wanna print that picture after I've done everything to the picture I want, I simply come over and select it to print. So as my mouse works for me, here we go. So it's just a regular option of selecting file and print and selecting my Rico printer. printer is already selected for me because that's the last printer I used. And I have options that I can control in here as well on the properties key. And these property keys tell me to really set the printer so I can tell whether I'm printing on thin fabric or medium fabric or thick fabric. I can tell it whether I want to print in color or in black and white, just like your regular printer. If you've got a color printer, you always have an option of printing in color or black and white. So here I can set my options for the printer. It's very simple. You see the item you want, you click on it. And the nice thing is it doesn't have 500 options to play with. It's got three or four options. So it's very simplified and very easy for you to work with. Once I've got it selected, and right now I'm printing on a lightweight fabric. I'm just gonna leave it with my lightweight setting. I'm printing color and I'm gonna tell it okay. Now the other thing I need to know is what size of paper or what size of fabric I'm printing on. We have two platens available for one allows me to print basically a five by eight and the other allows me to print on an eight by 10. So I can actually put my shirt or my fabric into the tray, the platen, which goes into the machine. So here I would simply select the size of that I'm working with. This is an A5, so this is my five by eight. And that's what is gonna print my picture. So you see, I have a preview here as well. It's nice to be able to see what I'm gonna print beforehand because basically this is giving me a, a resizing of my image to match the print size. So if I'm done with that, I just simply tell it to print and it will print my image to my fabric. <clears throat> now, just to save us some time today, I've already printed this image. Barbara's gonna fix our camera so we can zoom out here and take a better look. So this is what my platen looks like. And you can see I've already printed the image. So when it's printed, this ink is wet. So you don't want to, you want to touch it until you fixed it. And to fix it, it's a very simple process. So it would have printed, I would have pulled it out of the top. I would have opened up the bottom here and put this into the bottom and set it for 30 seconds, which is actually just a matter of flipping the lever. At 30 second countdown, we'll stop. The unit will stop heating also, move it back to the middle and move it to the right for three minutes. Once that three minute timer is done, I can open the door, take my tray out, and this is now fixed and ready to wear, wash, and do whatever you'd like with. Doesn't matter whether it's black and white or color, it is truly that simple of a process. Now people wanna know, well, what can you print with and what does it do to the fabric? So you know what, I'm gonna take this out of here so you can see exactly what the fabric how it handles the ink. This is not sublimation. This is direct printing, like you're printing with an inkjet on paper, except we're printing onto fabric. So here's my picture printing. And I step up a little closer so you can take a better look at it. You can see I can wrinkle it up because it's not sublimation. It's not adding a layer to the fabric. 
the ink is actually being injected into the fibers and set into the fibers. So it's actually keeping the softness of the fabric. How many of you have a t-shirt or a garment that you bought and it's got a nice printing on it, but the printing feels hard because it's sublimation. It's got a coating laying on the fabric. It's giving another layer of stiff. This process doesn't give you that stiffness. So this remains nice and soft. You want to do something on baby's clothes. This is a great item, a great way to print a custom photo or, or thing in particular for a child's bit or something to keep it soft and wearable. So I did some other ones also because everybody likes to have a superhero around. So you know, here's some more samples of printing on the printer. Once again, they're all soft. It's a little running man. You can see it prints nice colors. You can print text on the fly. And truly, our Rico printer is more than just a printer because you actually can create art by printing. But it's really simple. And just to let you know, we're here with all brands and Juki and our Rico printer here at the EEM show. Yeah. I hope everybody enjoyed that. I'm seeing if somebody has some questions and maybe we can answer some for you. No questions yet, but where can they find this product to purchase? So this product, like many of our products that Juki has, is available online and you can find it at allbrands.com. You can also stop by one of the All Brands store and ask them about it. They will actually direct you to allbrands.com probably to get you the most up-to-date information. And of course, the nice thing about buying a Rico printer, it is one of those products that can be shipped directly to you. Yes, it comes in a couple of big boxes and there's a couple of options with it, but it's nice to know that, oh, I can wait at home for it to come ship direct to me. I don't have to go to the store and pick it up. Can't tell you how many times I've had people show up in a little car to pick up a big box and it doesn't fit in the little car because the box is much bigger than what they thought it was. Now this doesn't look like it's a big unit, but these machines come well packed and that box that it comes in is good size. If you probably had a Prius, it would fit into the back. But if you had a little Camry or something that didn't have a big trunk, you might find it difficult to get at home. So we've made arrangements that we can actually have it shipped direct from our warehouse to you when you order from allbrands.com or if you stop by one of their stores and order it that way. I hope we've answered the questions for you. Hope you enjoy the rest of your day. And if you have, if you happen to be in the Biloxi area, come and see us at the EEM show today. Thanks and have a great day, folks. Mm -hmm.